Hey BeatStars family, Promote is a great way to get more ears on your beats. And today I'm going to show you how to get the most out of your ad campaigns with the BeatStars Promote Strategy Guide. With BeatStars Promote, you can run ads for tracks, albums, or even your entire profile. Let's start with tracks. Tip number one, set up your ad campaigns to go along with new releases and your marketing. You want your marketing efforts and advertising to work together and maximize your ability to make sales. When you have a new release, you should be sending out an email blast, changing your featured track on your profile and pro page, sending out coupon codes, posting on social media, and finally running ads for your beats. Combining all these avenues of outreach, make sure you're covering both your existing audience and prospective customers. Your ad's effectiveness will go much farther if you support it with a real and robust marketing rollout. Then at the end of your campaign, you'll have numbers to look at to see how effectively your campaign worked to see if any adjustments need to be made. This is valuable right at the point of release because if this beat has the potential to do big numbers, you want to know that right away so you can prepare additional campaigns for the future and decide if you want to run more ads for it. Tip number two. Enable free downloads on your beats. People who visit your profile may not end up making a purchase today, but that doesn't mean it has to turn into a wasted trip. By offering free downloads for your beats, you can capture those customers' email addresses and use them to remarket to them later. This is a great way to stay in touch with them and continue to build your audience. Tip number three, double check your artwork, copy, licenses, and everything else associated with your tracks before you run ads. Make sure everything is good to go before running ads, so you aren't wasting your opportunities to make sales if there's an issue with your artwork or your payment methods that are preventing you from closing deals. Doing all the legwork beforehand will save you a ton of headache later, and you want everything to run smoothly while you're paying for that ad space. Now let's talk about albums. Tip number one. Look at trending searches to see what people are currently interested in, then create albums based around those. Albums are a great way to promote multiple tracks at once, but you want to make sure those tracks in the album are related, or else people will quickly lose interest and probably won't give every track in the album a chance. A great way to create focus within your album is to group together tracks for tight beats of one artist. If you see Lil Baby is trending, and you make Lil Baby type beats, Put together your beats into an album and run an ad for them. Customers looking for beats will appreciate the convenience an album provides, and you can offer them bonuses like one single price for multiple beat licenses. Tip number two, offer a good deal on your premium licenses for beat albums. Make sure you're offering a good deal for your higher tier licenses beat albums. If you want people to buy your most expensive album license during your ad campaign, Make sure there's a good discount for paying for the album versus just buying one track. You can use the description of the track to let people know that it's a limited time offer to help close the deal. Now let's talk about running ads for your profile. Tip number one, update your bio to include your latest deals, special promotions, and holiday events, and add any other info you want your customers to know. When people click on your ads to visit your profile, you want them to know all the important information about your store. Let them know who you are, what your latest deals are, maybe tell them about your mailing list or throw in a limited time offer. This is your chance to communicate directly with potential new customers. Running ad campaigns that go along with a coupon or bulk deal will encourage customers to click on your ads and make purchases quickly. Try changing your track title to include your bulk deal like this example here. You can also edit your bio to include any discount code you want your customers to know about. This way, when people click on your ad and see your profile, they'll know you have a limited time offer available and check out your catalog to see which tracks they want to purchase. Tip number two, make sure everything you offer in your store is active and up to date. If you've been neglecting setting up a service, memberships, merch, or anything else, now is the time to do it to make sure you're getting the most out of your profile visits. You don't want to run an ad for an incomplete profile. When people visit your page, you want them to be able to purchase everything you have available. So take that extra time before your campaign begins to look through your profile and make sure you're happy with all your products. Consider updating your artwork, maybe update your licenses, create a membership plan, 
anything that can give you that advantage during your promotional period. Thank you for watching this video. For more videos like this, subscribe to BeatStars and check out help.beatstars.com.